So this uh, bullying case that is trending right now in Nigeria, I think, in my own opinion, I think uh, we are all going about it the wrong way. Because first of all, the question I asked myself is, who recorded the video? That was the first question that came to my mind. Who recorded the video? Is it a fellow student? Was it a teacher? If it's a fellow student, the next question I have to ask is, since when do secondary school kids come to school with mobile phone? I remember during my time, you're not allowed to come to school with a mobile phone. So since when do secondary school kids come to school with a mobile phone? Another question I had to ask is, why are Nigerians going about this the wrong way? saying the school must be shut down. Since when does bullying result to shutting down the whole secondary school? Guys, make it make sense. We know, yes, bullying is a bad thing. It's never going to end. But saying that the whole school system, the whole secondary school should be shut down because once one kid, one child was bullied. Nah, it's not called for. The only thing that you are requested to do in this scenario is call the kid that was bullied, call the kid that bullied them. Ask the necessary question that matters. Get to the root of what resulted to the whole bullying matter. Because the lady that the kid that was slapping the other kid didn't just wake up one morning and decide, you know what, today I'm going to slap this kid. No, something must have prompted that whole bullying. So get to the root of it. If you have to punish. The school is not allowed to be punished, in my own opinion. The only person that is allowed to be punished in this whole matter was the one, was the lady slapping her classmate. Cause, why? That's another question I have to ask, why? Why would you be slapping your classmate in front of everybody? And then also, the other classmate that were behind the scene, those one recording and those one motivating them, what are you being taught in school as a classmate or what has our school system become that you see two people fighting or you see someone bullying another person and your first instinct is let me just sit back and watch this thing play out no the first thing you should have done is approach them put a stop to the whole fight then go to the principal's office but who am i i'm just a youtuber let me know what your thoughts are down below guys because this thing has been trending for the whole day i've made a short video about it but i decided you know what since everybody has their opinion about it let me make a longer video about it so let me know what your thoughts are do you think federal government shutting down the school for three days to investigate is the best course of action for this whole bullying thing or do you think federal government doesn't have any right to shut down the whole school let me know down below and i'll see you guys on the next video bye bye